Hey, what's going on guys? Joe here coming at you today from Clash of Clans and today we're going to pick up on our previous conversation from last night about Town Hall 13 and its confirmation. Uh, going back and reviewing some of the AMA conversation with Darian and some of the questions that were asked and obviously one of the questions that did get asked is will Town Hall 13 be coming this year? And I do want to kind of go over this post a little bit and discuss it and kind of go in explaining some things you know because it can't be misconstrued it can't be twisted and there was no timeline but he does in fact confirm town hall 13 as it is coming out but he doesn't have a timeline on it or whether it's going to be this year or next year and we've already kind of speculated on this a little bit uh and i'm going to read some of it for you he does mention that uh, we have two updates planned for the rest of the year so it is already july and we are moving in into the anniversary for Clash of Clans. Uh, Clash of Clans anniversary is in August, so we should see some stuff coming out about that time frame. But I don't, I don't believe that's going to be a massive update. Uh, we could probably see something about the September time frame, massive wise, and then probably the December update. Uh, while we don't have generally announced major updates like a new town hall until they're ready to be announced, we have updates planned for mid to late autumn. So obviously September, October time frame, and then one more at the end of the year. So more than likely your Christmas update. We already talked about that in the live stream. Uh, he says, since we have ESL World Finals at the end of October, we won't introduce a new town hall level before the ESL Finals have completed as introducing a new town hall level would throw the entire competition into disarray. So what that means is they are basing everything around, you know, the current competition that they announced early in the year. Every month we've all, we've seen a live stream of top competitive clans coming in, battling it out for their chance to be in the finals in October. So they're not going to introduce a new town hall level in October, obviously, because they don't want to mess up what's going right now with town hall 12. He also says, with that said, it took us two and a half years to introduce Town Hall 12. So if you guys remember or have been playing long enough, Town Hall 11 was introduced in December of 2015. And then obviously June of 2018, to, you know, Town Hall 12 comes out. So that was a, a two and a half year long period there. And they're saying that we don't want a t the same time gap in between Town Hall 12 and Town Hall 13. So that's understandable. They don't want you guys being maxed out for a really, really long time waiting for an update and just hoping for something. And that happened quite a bit over the years. It's not giving anything away by saying that there will be a Town Hall 13 at some point. So there is going to be a Town Hall 13 at some point. While this is not a hard commitment to timelines, we would like to release a new Town Hall level every 18 months or so. So June to June, 12 months. So we're looking about the end of the year, the possibility, the possibility of Town Hall 13, but that is not confirming Town Hall 13. He does not state specifically that we are going to see Town Hall 13 this year, although he does mention that they have pretty big updates slated for the end of the year. So feel free to speculate like we're doing right now and try to read between the lines, if you will. But it's going to be a friggin massive update, a friggin massive update and some really cool new features. So there, it's really limited information and it's it's typical Supercell when it comes to uh giving us a little bit of a bone but not giving us too much that's going to leave us thinking that there's going to be something right away it's kind of like saying we're going to give you something we're going to give you something new but we're not going to put a timeline on it so it doesn't hold us to a specific standard and that we have to do it right at that time and meet that specific deadline so i mean it's it's really up to what you guys want to believe we did just see a major update in builders hall 9 we got some more additions at builder or at, at town hall 12 I did read in a lot of, so I did scrub through in 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 depth uh, scrubbing of this uh, AMA, and he does mention that they're taking a look at the clan war or at the clan stuff in general, like actually looking at clans and how they're built and adding some new stuff there for or developing the clan features, adding some features. I didn't see see anything about any mention of clan perks. I, I really wish I had known this was going on because I would have definitely asked him about clan perks. Uh, I, I feel like clan perks is really lacking. And what I mean by that is that we've had 10 levels or level 10 perks 
for a couple of years now, probably. I think the last edition there was probably like 2016 timeframe. I could be wrong. That's just an estimate there that I'm trying to recall. It's been that long since we have seen an actual update or an addition to clan perks. And there's many level 20 clans out there now. I've seen a level 22 recently and I was like, my goodness, what is the purpose other than having that pretty legend shield backing up the clan badge itself? Where is the actual, I mean, it's just bragging rights. There's nothing really there to achieve. All you have to do is get to a level 10 clan and you're pretty much made it. So hopefully we'll see something in the sense of clan perks. But I mean, for the most part, they asked about uh, some Builders Hall 10. They said that there is nothing for Builders Hall 10 in the works right now. Uh, they just released Builders Hall 9. So they're not even thinking about Builders Hall right now or even considering it as an option. They are more focused on the Town Hall side so that is definitely something that you guys probably want to hear and I can imagine based on an 18 month you know we want to put out another town hall level every 18 months then we might see something in December normally the updates come out in December are pretty big so there's a possibility with the ESL championships being over in October that they might in fact roll out with an update with a new town hall but we will have to wait and see how that develops out and plays out and it could be something massive it could play into that massive term or that friggin massive term that he speaks of so uh yeah i just wanted to kind of hammer in on that one a little bit guys that that just kind of weighed on me we talked about it briefly i didn't really get in depth on the question when i was on the live stream so i definitely wanted to come back to this topic and talk about it a little bit and uh just kind of throw my thoughts out there on that one it would be great it would be awesome to see another town hall level in the future very very soon it would definitely provide us some new content to play with and give us something new to work with especially for you guys that are near maxed out at town hall 12 already uh, it'll definitely give you a reason to bounce up to the next level and hopefully we'll see some really cool stuff in the future that just can just completely changes and enhances the game from what it currently is i'm not going to say it's in a bad place it is definitely in a good place right now the clearing of blue skies I personally enjoy being up in Legend League right now. I don't have to wait for attacks. I'm able to get in there and knock out some attacks and get to work and then move on to another account. Uh, some want more attacks, some want less. I mean, sometimes I just go through the day trying to get done with those eight attacks, but that's just me. We all play differently, right? Uh, anyways, that is going to wrap us up for today, guys. I just wanted to talk about that Town Hall 13 thing a little bit today. Um, what, are you, what are your thoughts? Drop it down in the comments below for us. And if you enjoyed the content today, smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And thanks for watching, guys. <laughs>